Yeah, my name is Pastor Murabe. I reside and minister in Kisi, a Kisi town, with the Judge Gospel Embassy Chapel, which is registered by the government of Kenya. We are requesting the president and the political class uh, to suspend the political, or what we call the BBI rallies. The church, particularly our church, is not against the BBI, but through the voice of God, and from what we are able to see that's going to happen to Kenya, we request that the BBI rallies be suspended. On Saturday the 29th, the Lord spoke to me uh, on what is going to happen to Kenya if the PBI rallies are not suspended. And because they started from Kisi, the Lord commanded me to suspend all the rallies again from Kisi. And that is why I stood on the altar on Saturday the 29th and I suspended all the BBI rallies. As far as our church is concerned, the BBI rallies stand cancelled. Yeah, during, um, during our morning prayer on, on Saturday, as I was praying with my wife leading the members in the church, the Lord said, if those who are propagating um, the so-called BBI rallies are not going to stop, He will stop their voices, uh, even from speaking the, the intention. Because God wants the best for this country, and that's why it's in record, as my wife was praying, the Lord said, He will mute the voices of those that want to continue speaking as a sign that he doesn't want the BBI rallies to continue in Kenya. The Kenyan politicians are aware of what is going on. Each, of course, they say this is not about position. It's about uniting the country. Which country? Kenya has, is and has always been a united country. We do not have tribalism, as they say. It is actually the political class that teaches the Kenyan civilian on how to become divided along ethnic and tribal lines. Otherwise, if you take away the politicians from Kenya, the Kenyans will have the most will be the most peaceful country. In fact, we are more united than Tanzania. We are more united than Tanzania. Kenyans, as Kenyans, are united. We are always united until the politicians say we are not united. So the BBI is building bridges where there's no river. The road is continuous. There has never been a river in Kenya that requires a bridge to be constructed. I know many people may be against this, but the truth is we have never been divided until the politicians told us to be divided. I'm appealing to the political class, if at all they fear God, let them obey this voice this time. I, I have not been shown any consequences, except that if they proceed, many of them will be losing their voices as a sign that God really doesn't want that. But the truth is, Kenya may suffer as a nation for failing to uh, for failing to hear the voice of God. Kenya may suffer as a nation. And uh, I want to appeal to the I know the politicians what they will do. Many of them say we will run away from this country to any other place. But the truth is we need Kenya still as one country. And for Kenya to remain a united country the BBI rallies must stay.